Welcome to Carolyn Braden's Turning the Ordinary into the Extraordinary. Today I'm going to show you how to make some easy crystal post earrings. Here are the items you will need for your project. To get started, take your earring studs out of their bag and I am using some sterling silver ear studs that have six millimeter blanks. Take them out of their bag and take the backs off and stick them into, stick the studs into the piece of scrap styrofoam that you have found probably lying around your house like I did. Do it to the second one. Ooh, these are tough. Ah, okay, got them. I'm making two pair today. So you, if you're only gonna do one pair, then you only obviously need one pair of earring studs. Let's keep the backs in the little pouch they came with and set those aside. And I am making a pair with some teeny tiny crystals that I found at my local crystal store. These were $3.30 because they weigh them based on, or they price them based on how much they weigh. So I picked two that do not look alike. I've got a, some kind of a drop and a little circle. And this drop kind of has a flat back and the circle kind of has a flat back, but they'll still work. So I'm going to make a pair of moonstone crystal studs and a pair of magnetite crystal studs. Now let's see this up close so you can see exactly what I'm doing. Okay, to get started, I'm gonna take my E6000 glue and I'm gonna put it into a paper plate. Make sure we get that cap back on. And I'm just using a simple toothpick. You could use a Q-tip for this, but then you'd be dealing with some cotton, and so that's why I'm using just a toothpick. So I'm gonna take a little bit of glue and get it on that toothpick, and then put it onto the earring stud. I'm watching how much I get on there because I don't want it to ooze out the sides too much. Put that on and then just take my moonstone figure out what side I want to be the top it's got some nice shine to it on both sides I think I want this to be the top I'm gonna set it on the stud just like that then I want to do the same thing for the other one a little bit of glue and then stick my crystal on top. And they're done. All I have to do at this point is make sure that they sit overnight so they can dry, and I have my crystal earrings. That simple. We could do it to the other one too because of how simple and quick it is. Magnetite and wipe off any excess with the toothpick. And there are my easy crystal studs. I'm gonna let these dry and then come back and show you what they look like on. And now the earrings are dry and ready to wear. I've got the moonstone in my hand and I'll show you an up close shot of that in just a moment. And I'm wearing the magnetite and I'm gonna wear them out shopping today. Thanks for watching Carolyn Braden's Turning the Ordinary into the Extraordinary. Visit Carolyn's Blooming Creations.com.